my journey. I, I want to share this not only from like the the client side, but also from the coaching side. So here's my journey in a nutshell. Uh, we get approached all the time here at the training center because we've been in the business for over two decades. We've taught at universities for massage therapy. We have taught at high levels for strength and conditioning. We've done things for nutrition, for mental training, for sports coaching. We, we've been all over the place and we were everywhere that is relative to human performance because we're human performance couches and advisors. So like the, the logos up on the wall are some of the different colleges that we've worked with, um, with our student athletes going there and then professional sports team and different events as well that they've gone to and been successful with. So throwing that out there first. Now the reason why I want to talk to you about my experience not only as a client but also as a coach is because if you choose to be a client, eventually you'll probably want to consider being a coach. Why? Because it makes sense and it's fun and you can help other people really help themselves in a way that you probably don't even realize that you can unless you're you're already in that field unless you're already a teacher in some way shape or form an instructor a professor uh, a coach maybe you're a boss and you get a chance to like to teach people and work with people you, you know so if you're in some leadership capacity like it's fun to get to mentor and help other people grow and experience things in our life that maybe they didn't believe was even possible which is crazy just from a selfish standpoint like I get to feel good about that and Melissa does as well so Melissa had gone on her uh, started her journey and she was doing great uh, she's already a beautiful woman anyway and she just it just kept on making everything better about her life like she was she was more efficient with her communication she was better with her habits she was doing better in her workouts, she was feeling better about herself, she was experiencing more energy and more joy in her life and all these other things and we already had a great relationship to begin with and everything got better. And I'm not saying this like it's foo foo it's like, oh, it's, you know, it's a magic pill, it's none of that stuff, but if you do the work, if you follow the program, it's crazy what can happen. So for starters, me, I'm 55 to 60 pounds down on the scale on any given week. My, my strength has gone up. My strength was already good to begin with. Like I could already have like, I already had good absolute strength and also relative strength. My body weight strength was still good even when I was 60 pounds heavier. So that's only even better now. I've probably lost 70 to 80 pounds of fat through the process. My energy's through the roof. It was always decent, but now it's phenomenal. It's also sustainable. So I get to bring more to work and to be more impactful and a better role model also in what I'm doing at work. And it doesn't matter if you're not, you know, a strength and conditioning coach or a human performance or like in any area of your life, you have people that are looking up to you because you'll have family members, you'll have people at work that's looking like, oh, so-and-so does this. So how are you having, you know, your triple bottom line impact? When we were in Vermont, we were a part of Vermont's businesses for social responsibility and there were some phenomenal people in there and there was a lot to learn. And the three things that they talked about was the triple bottom line was how you impacted people with what you're doing, your profit, and also the planet. Now I can tell you right now, in health coaching, those three areas you massively, positively impact. People are in better shape, so you're saving the planet through their carbon footprint, which is massively reduced, right? They're, they're using less and they're helping with, you know, you know, create better resource opportunities for the planet. But they're massively reducing their carbon footprint. Number two, you're creating um, better opportunities for people to get more out of their lives, right? By getting better habits on board for them so that they can get out of their own way many of the times. And one of the other things that you're doing that's also helping the planet and helping out society is you're creating a tool, a resource, an opportunity to help somebody profit-wise in their life, help people feel good about that emotionally. Profit from that financially and physically, right? Man, that's the, that's the trifecta. And you get to do that and you get to teach them that and they get to pull themselves out of, they get the, you give them the shovel and you say, listen, you gotta use it, but if you keep shoveling, you keep doing the work, eventually you're gonna dig yourself out and then you're gonna have all of this dirt that you can use to build whatever life you wanna build. And it's as easy as that. And it's absolutely incredible. And what you have to do first is just say, I want to find out more information about this and then just start and get out of your own way. 
in life, there is no guarantee for anything that you're going to do, except for your, if you're here, you were born. The only other guarantee, as far as I know, is that you're going to die at some point. In between whatever happens is really up to you. If you wanna be a victim, this is not, this is not the way to go for you. But if you wanna be a champion of your own life, if you wanna take charge, if you wanna see what's possible, what's on the other side of like, you know, that beautiful row of hedges, what's going on over there? What life could be like? How much joy could I physically handle and emotionally handle in one day? How good does it feel to have people say thank you all day long and genuinely mean it? Like, hey, thank you for being so positive and so helpful in my life. That feels good. And I'm not being foo-foo-y or fluffy. It feels good. Like I got goosebumps right now. I was just thinking about the last thank you that I got from somebody. It's awesome. It's helped every area of my life. Let it help yours.